Uh, the last two years been like for you? Hmm. Um, uh, pretty tough. I think the toughest part was in the beginning. Um, but I was lucky enough to have to go through my second Tommy John with Brandon Beachy, his second Tommy John, uh, Peter Moylan, his second Tommy John. So I mean, uh, Johnny Venner's his third. So. I, you know, we didn't give each other a chance to feel down on ourselves or anything like that. So it was, um, you know, we just we drew a lot of inspiration from each other and kept kicking each other's asses and then, uh, you know, not letting us get a day off. Hey, Chris, how do you feel about the way your rehab starts when? I mean, in the beginning, I was a little nervous because I felt like I had never thrown a baseball before. Really? But, uh, yeah, I mean, it just kept getting better and better. And um, that last one was pretty encouraging. The seven innings, you know, no runs. Didn't give up a home the first time. So, uh, <laughs> Yeah, it was uh, overall, I mean, it just kept getting better and better, and that took me to where I am today, and I'm ready to go. What was the best part of, in terms of what came together in that last start? Is it just getting your command back, or is it the velocity? Is it all, like, what, what got better for you in that last start? Well, I've never been, like, huge on velocity. I mean, I would look up, look up every once in a while to uh, to check to see if I'm maintaining it, but um, it's just, I'm a, I'm a guy who has to have, you know, all three or four of my pitches going to uh, to be effective, and that, that last start, that's exactly what I had. I was jumping ahead, throwing the on my fastball where I wanted to, and um, the long change of kind of fell into place, so that, uh, that definitely made, you know, for my mind, made everything a lot, a lot better confidence-wise, and like I said, I, I, I asked for a, a, a sixth start so I can, you know, have that feel and, and, uh, and come here comfortable and, you know, ready to go. You felt like you had never thrown a ball before. Was that markedly different than the first time you came back from Tommy John surgery and had to throw? The first time was so different because I didn't, um, I didn't do the rehab assignment stuff. Um, I had popped some scar tissue in a bullpen and got shut down and then got activated when the rosters were expanded. So I just got put on the team and, and uh, you know, come in uh, game 162 that, that crazy day when Longoria hit a home run and everything happened within like five minutes. Um, I came in for Craig Kimbrell, the bases loaded. It was my second outing and, you know, got out of it. So I don't know how, but that, that was kind of thrown into the fire. So this was a lot different, um, the, the building up and, and all that stuff. Uh, feeling a little bit more frustrated with, with stuff and, and feel, but, you know, that like I said, that last one just kind of put me at ease a little bit. And, you know, it'll be a, a different stage today or whenever it is I, I, I do get in the game. But I'm ready for it. Is there, is there nerves or anxiety about when you're getting on the mound for the first time? Um, I don't know. I mean, I think even when I have a start in double A or triple A, I mean, I still have those nerves um, that the, the butterflies, the belly, and all that stuff. I think that's a, it's a normal thing. Um, it's no anxiety, just nerves and, you know, competing again it was a pretty, pretty fun feeling that I hadn't had in a while. And, um, you know, it's a, it's very exciting. Because you mentioned that you're, you're joining a team that's having success. They've been patient, you've been patient, you've worked hard. How much has that patience helped over the last six, seven, eight years? A ton. I mean, I know that was expected coming in with um, a, a second uh, second surgery, but, you know, overall, just uh, the, the team willing to wait, but I think, was, was the biggest thing. Um, you know, with the signing a two-year deal, I mean, a chance to kind of you know, be patient and then see how it feels and then slowly build up and, and, and make sure I was 100% comfortable on the mound before, uh, before I came back. I mean, that's, that's good for my mind and we are people. We are people, we're not robots. So, I mean, the, the personal side comes into play and, you know, uh, I didn't see my family as much this year with, you know, all the travel I've done. So, it's so overall just a, a tougher year than I'm, than I'm used to, but all worth it. I mean, today's a big day for me and my family. We're just all really excited.